Hey what's up guys, it's Minfi here and today I'm going to be playing some Black Ops 6. For today's video, I'm going to be starting my playthrough of the Black Ops 6 campaign. So for this year, I figured I would do something a little bit different compared to last year. Last year, I basically just grabbed all the highlights from the Modern for 3 campaign, but I have heard that the Black Ops 6 campaign is significantly longer, so I decided for this year I would spice things up by doing a playthrough of the Black Ops 6 campaign. Alrighty, so I'm on the campaign page right now, and this is what the first mission is called. It's called Bishop Takes Rook. For now, I will be playing this on recruit but maybe in the future i'll try this out on harden or maybe even veteran typically when i play campaigns i do like to play them on recruit just so i know what i'm doing and then i come back in later and finish a campaign on veteran just for fun anyways let's go ahead and continue we have our first cinematic Mr. Gorbachev, open this gate. Ooh. an entire class of u.s soviet nuclear missiles is eliminated Alrighty, so they're showing the characters off so far. Noise, noise. Kind of a brief introduction. Alrighty, we have Felix and then we have Frank Woods. <laughs> this feels classic in a sense, by the way, this whole cutscene so far. I love it. It's very clean. <laughs> Ooh, that's so nice. I'm excited. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Are you denying that? We have discussed what it all. What more do you want, Livingston? Enough! You disobeyed a direct order, Mr. Marshall, when it was clear your op was compromised. With all due respect, sir, you weren't there. And the group that compromised you, the Pantheon. You sure that's who they were? That's what Alawi called them. When are you going to tell us what's really going on here? I'm asking the questions, Mr. Woods. Sir, if you read the report, you I read your report, Ms. Harrow. Some of it I still find hard to believe. That's why we're going to go over events again. Only this time, I want to hear it from Marshall. From the beginning. We were in position near the Iraq-Kuwait border. Small team. Me, Harrow, and Case. <laughs> Allow he is ahead of schedule. Whoever he's meeting won't wait around for long. No. Not if it's a smuggler. I'm sure Lowry has paid top dollar to get himself out of the Middle East. Guess it doesn't really matter. He's coming with us. Outlaw 42, we've got our eyes on the convoy. Paying the target, over. Roger, ground. Target confirmed. Waiting on your go. Over. Do it. Outlaw 42, you're clear to engage. Out. Let's go get him. Copy, ground. Engaging and out. Here comes the traffic jam. Okay. But, uh, straight to the Xville point. Yes, yes. Do not consider it. Five minutes. Five minutes. Alawi is a minister of defense and close to Saddam. His guys will be well trained and heavily armed. I guess we're trying to get someone. Got it. Two targets down. I'm kind of following them, by the way. Oh, gosh. Another one. They'll know we're here soon. Be ready. Right ahead. This is looking nice so far, by the way. No, I don't think I will. I got eyes on Alawi's truck, middle of the road. With 
Alrighty, so we're about to go capture him. Okay, take the door. Why me? Why do I have to do it? I don't wanna. You do it. <laughs> oh god, hi. <laughs> oh, he got bugs. I got it. Stay calm. We're not here to hurt you. CIA, we had a deal. A deal? Not with us. Where you headed? Corrado, you lied. Your man was getting me out. Man. Who exactly? Is that us? Hmm? No, not Iraqi either. Pantheon. Pantheon. We need to leave. You uh, is our character okay? <laughs> spotted us. Let's keep it that way. Come on. Let me get this straight, Mr. Marshall. The group you claim to be, the Pantheon, was a multinational, heavily armed paramilitary force showed up out of the blue at this point you're told to wait for backup but you decide to play cowboy instead we had to act fast our window Ms. was Harrell, closed did he or did he not disobey your order yes sir but the accelerated timetable that's what i thought i've come to expect this from you but not from you sir our objective was to recover alawi by any means necessary oh, i'm that aware so, care to explain why he's on a slab in the morgue right now? Things got... complicated. Who are these people? The Pantheon is composed of former European and US operatives. I don't know who leads them. They're blocking our ex -fill. Very interesting. The cinematics and how seamlessly they flow into the gameplay. Where did your way? No, we're compromised. Alawi will slow us down. Alawi, you going with us to the Pantheon? I'm going with you. Damn it, Troy. Smart man. Okay, so let's start by softening them up. Oh, okay, so we have an equipment wheel. I believe this is new, and I'm gonna go ahead and read this real quick. Alrighty, let's go ahead and use the RCXD. Here it is. Ooh, fun. Huh? Wait. No, no, I'm trying to detonate. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> yes, I'm totally not a noob. This is why we play it on recruit first, because you have to understand what's happening first of all, and obviously not walk through the fire like I did. On a side note though, if you guys ever want to see me play games on veteran, let me know. My favorite game that I've ever completed veteran on was the original Monarchy 2 and Halo Reach. Not too bad. Is this guy in last stand? <gasps> Look at him. Look at him. Oh, teammates took him. Armor. Nice. I can put on armor. Alrighty. I think we have like one more enemy left. There he is. I don't know about you guys, but I'm having just a little bit of difficulty seeing the enemies, but that's okay. Are you sure he'll be there? You just worry about not slowing us down. We're open targets down here. And they'll get pick us apart. So we're gonna go over here and Hopefully not get ambushed. What? 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 Oh! I thought I heard an airplane. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm not awake enough for this right now. Oh dear. Oh, you know, I think the other thing I'm kind of having a little bit of difficulty with this campaign is it's kind of hard to tell when the enemy is dead. So I feel like I'm kind of shooting them a little bit more than I need to. Whoa. That was unlucky. <laughs> Alrighty, I think that was it there. Clear. Yep, yep, that was it. Awesome. I wanna go up here. Right, Let me go up help. here. Oh, we have the KSV as our secondary weapon. Although I don't think I get to use it. Or I might, because we have to jump. Whoa. Yeah, lead away, case. We're going. Woo! Oh. Oh, that's our backup. I think we're good. Everyone all right? Is this your... No, 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 no! Huh? Oh, dear. Adler. Stand down! Oh my god, why would he do that? Wait till Woods gets a load of this. Goddamn Russell Adler. CIA traitor. You've been on the run, what, 10 months? Marshall, huh? Woods' new project. You can ease up, son. I'm all done here. 
Jane. You just killed a high-value target in cold blood and put our national security at risk. Palawi can't fall into the Pantheon's hands or Langley's. The CIA is compromised. But it's not me. I'm just the fall guy. Fall guys? You expect us to believe that? Hey, Jane, you want to tape his mouth shut for me? Yes. Wait. I got a message for Woods. Oh, yeah? Tell him Bishop takes Brooke. What the hell is that supposed to mean? I'm with Marshall. What does that mean? Time to go. In the truck. Alrighty. Case, you got the launcher? We'll shoot him down. I do have a launcher now. Oh my goodness. There, on our Where? You can't him. Take him out. He has flares. No. <laughs> what the hell are you waiting for? There you go. Did it get him? Okay, I guess not. There we go. And he's gone. Look at that. <laughs> oh. Oh my god. <laughs> else to add? Sir, despite breach of conduct and losing Alawi, apprehending Russell Adler is a categorical windfall. Yes, Ms. Harrow. Bringing in a rogue operative is certainly a win. Russell Adler, the mole who betrayed us in Panama, the man responsible for your current condition, Mr. Woods. So why was he trying to tell you something in Kuwait? Bishop takes Rook. Any idea what that means? No clue. Okay, then. Based on Harrow's reluctant report and the withholding of critical information regarding Russell Adler, your team is suspended. Are you for real? This is bullshit. As for you, Miss Harrow, consider yourself on very, very thin ice. People like me and Adler are the reason we ain't speaking Russian right now. The Cold War is over, Mr. Woods. That makes you and Russell Adler the last global gunslingers of a bygone era. Take this time to reflect on that. Dismissed. All of you. My office in five. I'd advise you not to pursue this further, Marshal. need to be scars <clears throat> why are we here Harrow because you know something care to tell me what it is you're up to I mean the kids just need some time away you know take a little trip reflect a little look I can cover your asses on my end best I can but if things go sideways again you're on your own copy that Oh, you one. One? Yeah. Try a dozen. Do me a favor, Troy. Don't get yourself killed. I'll see what I can do. Bishop takes Rook. Of course, Woods knew what it meant. Adler was pointing us somewhere. The Black Sea. According to Woods, 15 years ago, he and Adler discovered an abandoned KGB safe house in Bulgaria. Ooh. Is this a safe house that they were talking about in the patch notes? The Last year before Adler disappeared. I think we had to see it. Rumors of a dangerous paramilitary group. One receiving orders from inside the CIA. He believed the Pantheon was developing a new type of weapon. With plans to unleash something the world had never seen before. And wouldn't you know it, 
Soon evidence surfaced incriminating Adler himself, and he fled. To this place. What we found here over the last couple days has changed everything. Now I'm questioning what I believed about Adler, about Livingston, about the CIA itself. I have my doubts about going dark on Jane. Woods might be right about her value on the inside, but she'll be in the crosshairs if Langley learns what we're up to. Adler brought us here for a reason, to stop the Pantheon before they strike. To do that, Woods believes we'll need him back. That won't be easy. But Adler left the name to follow. It's a good place to start. No more wasting time. You know the plan. What's the plan? Somebody do my, the person you're gonna meet. Still no idea why Adler was in contact with her, but a lead's a lead. We can't trust her. I doubt if Adler did. Hell, for all we know, she's part of this fucking pantheon thing. Who can we trust? Do my oh, I can move. <laughs> case in that one, so we're doing this. Well, well, well. Look at you putting your big boy pants on. Shouldn't we find Adler before making this call? Well, that's exactly why I'm going to Munich to wine and dine your old friend. Friend? <laughs> Hardly. I can't stand the son of a bitch. But we need him. Sometimes you just gotta hold your nose. If he's as good as you say he is, by the time Case gets back, we'll have located Adler. If Livingston hasn't already stuffed him in a barrel. Op details are up on the board, Case. I'm headed out, so hit me up soon if you need anything. Okie dokie. <laughs> I've got a few ideas on how we can polish this turn of a safe house case. Let's talk when you have a minute. Sounds good. Okay. So before we go ahead and do all of that, let's go ahead and explore the safe house. What's here and what's not here? Can we access anything? I really am curious to see if you can access like a computer, almost like in Black Ops 1 when you were in the main menu. You can basically access the computers and check things out. Oh, I can open this. Okay, let's do that. Open. Oh, <laughs> Ooh, this is so pretty. Oh my goodness. Look at that. That is really pretty. Wow. Can we just take a moment to just appreciate how beautiful this location is? Holy cow. I love the mood they have on here too. It's giving a hoa hoa hoa, if you know what I mean. How far can we go? Are you... Okay. Does that not look like someone sitting there with their back turned? Oh my goodness. I thought that was an actual person. I also want to jump, but I can't jump. I didn't realize that was a thing. I just thought, you know, if I go to the edge, the game will have an invisible barrier. <laughs> Turns out you die. <laughs> what else do we have here? Also, I'm getting like major Left 4 Dead vibes from this forest area and it's very creepy. What's this? Read? So we have a to-do list on here and it tells us to do a bunch of things. We have to get the furnace going, investigate the piano, get rid of the bats. Seems like we have a big to-do list. What do they mean by investigate the piano and get rid of the bats? Was that a bunny? Where'd the bunny go? What's this? Black light? Okay. Ooh, the piano. <laughs> what does it mean up here? What? What is this? R, C, something? I don't understand this. You can tell there's something here because the key is different, but I don't understand this uh, puzzle. Is there anything that I'm missing with the black light? It doesn't seem like it. It just seems like it's right here. I might come back to that later and figure that out. But for now, it does look like we have some footsteps. Where does this go? Let's follow it. I don't really notice anything too crazy. The footstep stops here, but there's not anything that I can do over here. Let's go ahead and keep exploring. I do want to figure out the furnace thing and get rid of the bats if I can. Creepy hallway. Oh, hey, a door. Open. <laughs> anything I can see with this? No, no. I'm going to keep it on in case there is something that basically just pops up. Oh, here's the furnace and it's totally uh, on the fritz right now. <laughs> I'm thinking this boiler might be providing power to a hidden part of the safe house we haven't found yet. Placed a black light upstairs if you want to do some investigating from Marshall. We have fuel, we have the boiler, and we have pilot. <laughs> what 
Let's just do this randomly. That's how I did it in Boulder Skate, at least. And then I somehow got it. Turn on the pilot light with the fuel line fully open. Is it working? Reason unknown. Oh, okay. So we have to find water to do this. Okay. Where would we find water? There's so much exploring to do in here. I actually really like that. There's a door up there, but it doesn't open. 2 P.E. 3 cn what am i finding out just now what is this i don't know where the 3 cn leads to so we have the arrow and then four i gotta write this down i got a pen and we're gonna write down what is on the walls so the first thing we have is one mn and the next thing is right here which is 2 pe 3 cn and then we go over here there's nothing there it was just this arrow and we have four something that looks like an a but it's not i believe and then we have 5 pe okay so now that we have that all written out let's go ahead and put it in on the piano so we're just gonna go ahead and look for the first character we found which is the one mn we're gonna play this then we have to find pe which is this one and then we have to find cn which is this one then we have to put this one in which is the ao and then five we have to find the pe <gasps> it opened Ooh, what's down here oh my goodness i figured it out that's so cool what is all this should i take notes some bullet holes uh-oh can we open this nope it is locked okay oh you're leaving? Where are you going? You can't go. Nope. What did I think was gonna happen? What did I think was gonna happen? I'll see you back here on Thursday. No! Why is he trying to leave us? I thought we were friends. I can't even open this door. What the? What's going on with my character? I'm so confused. No! Stop it! This is rude. This is very rude. If I get behind him, he's just gonna reverse into me again. Okay. Well, it's nice knowing you. Bye, Marshall. Okay, well, since he's gone, I guess we should go talk to Woods now. Let's go ahead and find Woods. He's just right here. Hello. <sighs> All right. What kind of life savings you got? We have nothing. I live day to day. Tomorrow's never guaranteed. And we also have got about 3 million tucked away in stocks and real estate. I think for my character, I'm just gonna go with the first option. That a boy. Oh, nice. Garpe fucking deal. Yeah. <laughs> well, guess what? If we're really doing this, we've got to get financially creative. Okay, so what do we do? This place might have been fine for Adler, but for a team, I'm thinking overhaul. Mm -hmm. An armory, place to train, mm -hmm. gear bench, uh -huh. not to mention anything else we might end up needing. Okay. There's that won't be free, though. Let's go with how much money would we need. Marshall found a few grand stashed in one of the rooms upstairs. Other than that, we're starting fresh. No touching our own bank accounts either. Someone will be watching. When you're on a mission, look around for any cash lying around. You're gonna rob and hood your way through this. Steal from the rich and give to the poor. That's me. Okay. No, oh, wait, what? <laughs> that just registered into my brain. Anyways, let's see how Adler even found this place, I guess. We were following an old KGB trail and a single recording let us here. Seemed abandoned. When we asked our mole inside the KGB about it, he knew nothing. Belikov thought maybe it was some kind of splinter group, not sanctioned by the Central Committee. Whatever it was. I don't like where the camera is like going. Like, why is it looking over here? Since 1968. Yeah, I don't think he wanted to get others involved. Looks like he was working on a trust list. As far as I could tell. We didn't contact anyone. That's probably why Adler was talking to Dumas. Hmm. Keeping it outside of Langley. We're gonna do the same. At least for now. Okay. The board behind me is how we'll track our spending. Give it a look. Sounds good. Why are you just looking at your knife like that? Anyways, here's the board. We can basically use money found during missions to build out three new stations in the safe house. And each of them allow you to acquire operator perks, making you deadlier on the field. Okay. So we have training area, gear station, and weapons bench. So currently I'm torn between the training station and gear station. I feel like these two would be a solid choice. I don't know about the weapons all too much, but let's just go with the training area since that's the the first one. Oh, I thought you said you're gonna see us on Thursday. Where do you come from? You drove us over a moment ago too. So we have bought our stuffs and things. I want to see what we got. You have these dummies now, some lights, 
some cameras and we also have action oh yeah what did you put over here money found during missions can be used here to purchase new operator perks boosting your combat skills physical resilience and equipment loadout oh wow oh gosh these are all really expensive oh my god how am i gonna afford to get any of this i can basically only afford to get one of these things at the current moment eh. We'll skip up for now. I need to save money. So next thing I do have to go ahead and find this. We'll just check what's on here. Okie dokie. So the next mission is called Blood and Feud. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. We have to investigate the Pantheon, lead into Avalon while helping Zavati Dumas complete her mission. There are some rewards for this. Look at this reward. It looks so funny. And a challenge. Kill an assassination target with a throwing knife in Blood Feud. Okay. I really do wish you could track your challenges, but it looks like that's not a thing. But either way, let's go ahead and start Blood Feud. Adler didn't leave much intel on Savati Dumas, but I can tell you a thing or two about Avalon. It's a playground for the filthy rich, and crime factions run the whole city. Everyone's looking for who to push off the slide. When they pick a target, they hire someone like Savati. She used to be part of the guild, one of the most powerful Avalon factions, but now she freelances. Savati said that Adler hired her to follow a Pantheon trail. So you're gonna join her on that job tonight. We wanna see firsthand where that trail leads. Maybe we'll even add some muscle to the team. You'll scratch her back, but sure as hell watch your own. Trust is gotta be earned. Okie dokie, so here we are. Hmm. Ring ring. <laughs> Hello. Hello, Case. Hi. Check under the phone booth. <laughs> I hear frogs. <laughs> What's that? Oh, an earpiece? His name is Yannick, a broker for the guild. He'll be on his yacht tonight taking a call with the Pantheon. We'll be listening in. Okay. Once that call is finished, you'll finish Yannick. That'll draw the target I really want. But first things first. Where do I find this person? And maybe what should I know? Yannick traffics in weapons, narcotics, women. Whatever pays. Okay, so weirdo. Rumor has it the Pantheon wants a relationship with the guild. So Yannick is testing the waters. He's only our first domino. The real fun starts after we knock him down and get access to the target I really want. Johannes Eddy. And where do I find him? The bell tower on that church offers an open view of Yannick's yacht. He's throwing a party while his men count money in the church. Let's go ahead and ask her who she is. Close enough to know if you screw this up. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Let's see what you're made of, Case. Get to the bell tower. I don't care how. Quiet, loud, just get there. Okay, put my weapon away. I don't really want to hold a weapon if I'm going to be getting around places. Oh, who's this? That's not what I wanted. But it's okay. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Remain hidden and crouch to avoid enemy detection. If detected, quickly get out of sight to let things cool off. Okay, so we're gonna play the stealthy. Ooh, canals. Where does this go? Once we listen to Yannick's call and confirm a Pantheon date for Adler, I'm declaring open season on the guild. They have it coming. I should know. I used to work for them. How do I get to that tower? I never cared for Yannick's parties when I was with the guild. Though they were good practice in how to blend into a scene. Any girl who caught Yannick's eye was in for a long night. So let's cut his short. Never really thought about doing stealth missions. And this is like really well done too. Windows are open. Could climb up to the second floor. Where'd that one guy go? There we go. On a impossible menace. I feel like I'm playing this so badly, like I'm 
almost caught every single time. <laughs> okay, I'm going up the ladder now. This morning I stashed the rifle at the top of the tower. Yannick's near the umbrella, upper deck left side. Surrounded by girls. Let's go ahead and just keep getting up as high as we can. Let's go, Case. Find Yannick. Okay, I'm trying to be stealthy though. You can't rush stealth. I have made it to location. Who is sniper? Remember, we listen to the call first, then shoot. Okay, so we have to listen, but how do we listen? <sighs> Got your advance. My boys are still counting it. It's all there. Remember, this deal is one and done, huh? Don't need to get mixed up with the CIA. Oh, your pantheon thing. You'll send the hardware tonight, understand? That's not what we agreed to. Tonight, Yannick. Don't test me. So the Pantheon and the CIA are connected somehow. We got what we need. Take the shot. Is that the right person, though? I mean, I know it probably is, but it's not like a doppelganger or anything. Doesn't look like it, no. And he's just still chilling there. Oh, slow-mo. Oh. <laughs> Thanks. Now what? Yannick was just our first domino. We have more work to do tonight. Okay. Head back towards the payphone. I'll pull up in the white van. I'm just gonna snipe them out. Anyone else? I don't think so. Why am I quick scoping the guards? This is how we play. Bye bye. If you're not quick scoping, are you actually playing Call of Duty? That's also what's fun about playing on recruit. Just the goofiness. I'm almost at the car. You're Look at that. <laughs> Hello. Oh. Hello. Yes, let me in. I'm trying to get in. Let me in. Thanks. Hey, turn it down. That's Gabriel up there. He's cool. They called an emergency meeting at Chateau de la Haute Lune. Three guild leaders will be in attendance to smooth things over with Pantheon. I want to get paid, so we're going to crash that party. Chateau de la Haute Lune, let's go! The guild will lock the restaurant down and meet in a safe room on the second floor. Door can only be unlocked from the inside. You're gonna help me get that door open. We're a few minutes out yet. Just enough time to get changed. There we are. It's for guild security. Personally, I want these guild bastards dead. Pantheon's the icing on the cake for me. This is my stop. Get to the safe room's antechamber on the second floor. An alarm will go off. That's okay. The guild doesn't know you. So your best option is to surrender and play along. When you get inside, wait for my cue. Okay, do I need to take any of this stuff? Let's go ahead and equip that. Okay, so this is her target list, I guess. That's a lot of information taken, and I doubt I'm going to remember most of that. I was trying to see my equipment wheel. Looks like you can't access that quite yet. So let's go ahead and exit. Hopefully I'm not missing anything. The guild is meeting Pantheon right now. Get inside and find the safe room. Of all the guild assholes meeting tonight, the Sadie is the biggest. If we can't get them, consider me a no for your little club. Let's take him out. I keep forgetting, I'm pressing the wrong button. Anyways. Oh, that was the wrong button. Are you gonna come out and see what happened? The safe room is upstairs. Yes, I know the safe room is upstairs. I'm waiting for the guard to leave. Mm, we can drink after they're done meeting upstairs. Ah, come on, live a little. Uh, I'm going up. Don't be gone for long. <laughs> <laughs> that could have been really bad. <laughs> oh, it was. Oh, no. 
Oof. Oh no. I did a bad job. Yeah, I'm so glad I'm playing this on recruit. Doing so great. I feel like I messed up like so badly already. Oh yeah, I definitely messed up already. Okay, well there's no point of being stealthy, so I've just basically killed everyone. Ooh, it's this. I'm doing stuff. Is it closed? No, it needs to be wide. There you go. Three, four, nine, four. Ooh, money. Three, four, nine, four. Ooh, stuff. Awesome. Keep him out of the safe room. Yeah, I definitely went loud with this. Drop your weapon and put your hands on the glass. Hmm? Did I do something wrong? Oh no. <laughs> oh. Oh, gross. Wait for my signal, not before. Timetable's moved up. I want the shipment set tonight. You CIA types are all the same. And this one? <laughs> Troublemaker. Yes. Sorry about that. <laughs> Walked right into the lion's den. Alone. Oops. Uninvited. Maybe this one works for a rival, huh? Or maybe Pantheon is trying to squeeze us. We came to you, Asaidi. We'll learn the truth one way. <laughs> Ow. Or another. Show me your <laughs> Go ahead. Well, look at that. You're a long way from home, Case. This man is extremely dangerous. Kill him immediately. Aminato. Oh my. Pick the weapon up. Alrighty. Oh. Um, he ran away. I like the slow-mo scenes. It very much reminds me of the older Call of Duty games. Bastards don't even recognize me. We have to find him. It's like Cancel Doom. I think I just killed a civilian. Give me the gun, please. Thanks. Gotcha. I'm playing this like no one probably should play. Ooh, a shotgun. Don't mind if I do. Hello. Really no range to this. Oh, hi. I realized this guy was right here. Oh. I was about to die, but he died instead. Oh god! Oh god! Oh my god, that was not pretty. <laughs> there he is. Oh my goodness, how many bullets does he take? Go ahead and get him again. <laughs> I'm sorry, this just looked really funny. So I guess this goes without saying, but I probably will be very awful at the stealth aspect of this mission. Where is the safety? Check the street! Okay. Limo's coming down the street. Shoot! Am I getting him? Oh, I'm supposed to shoot the limo. Okay. I was trying to shoot him. Is he gone? He's gone now. <laughs> you happy? Oh, yeah. I guess she's happy. <laughs> Ready. Hello. Thanks for the pickup. Five star Uber. Five star Uber. Let me in. Nadler was right. The CIA might be behind Pantheon. Let's hope he isn't right about their mystery weapon. Maybe it's time you take me to this safe house of yours. Got word from Case. 
Savari Duma agreed to join us at the Rook, so we're two for two. I'm returning from Munich with Felix Newman. Newman's cut from a different claw, a brutal Stasi enforcer and a tech genius. He used to be a pain in the CIA's ass. That was before he gave the middle finger to the Stasi and defected to West Germany. Newman claims he's moved on from a life of violence and doesn't even arm himself anymore. But one way or the other, he couldn't turn down a chance to stick it to the CIA once again. He'll get that opportunity soon. He's gonna try to break into Langley's network and find out where they're holding Russell Adler. Still haven't warmed up to that sev yet, but hey, at least we didn't get killed in our sleep. I guess. <laughs> so where are we heading? Newman's been craking all night. Already got something. Come on. All right, Newman. Care to share? Please, call me Felix. No. We are all friends here. Yeah, of course. Russell Adler is in your Washington, D.C. black site. Yes. The subterranean one. They yes, right the operation there. Almost three years ago. D.C. black site. There are blueprints as well. They shouldn't have let me freely it move around. I'm just getting their faces. Underneath Capitol Station, I assume you're aware of this. I see. Well, it includes a small maximum security wing. That is where you'll find your prize. We need a game plan. You mean right? <laughs> I wouldn't be sitting here if I wasn't. I'll take that. Where are you no. going? Felix. Why are you leaving? I need to wait into that black site. Bruh. I'm still investigating vulnerabilities. Good man. Let me know when you got something, okay? He's six one. Holy cow, he is tall. So I can talk to everyone. I'm probably not gonna do that quite yet. Here's Woods enjoying the sunshine. He's enjoying the beautiful view. It's so pretty. Great work. Ooh, thank you. Case. Oh, what was that? It. Oh, okay. Thanks. I guess. Um, <laughs> I just wanted to see if he had anything to say. He had the bare minimum. Where did Marshall go? Did he leave? Oh, here he is. Hello. Might want to see what Felix is up to in the ops room. Okay, fine, 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 fine. Hello, Felix. I'm, I'm trying to talk to you. Where's the prompt? There it is. <laughs> ah, if you are looking for your camera, I'm afraid you've come to the right place. My apologies for not informing you in advance. What did you do to it? Just a few modifications, primarily. The addition of a miniaturized RF transmitter. And, of course, a more powerful battery. It won't last forever, but it should be sufficient for our purposes. Is that my tape recorder? Oh, this. Fortunately, it contains the exact electric condenser microphone I need. I found it in that pile over in the corner. You mean my stuff? So we have a few prompts. Why does the camera need a transmitter? And what else did you learn from cracking the CIA's network? I'm curious more about this one. Oh, so many fascinating things. The information your agency keeps on foreign assets is remarkable. Take our own Savati Duma, for example. Truly riveting material. <laughs> and I believe you have a flair for the dramatic. They have nothing on me. What did you find? Perhaps some other time. Okay. <laughs> what about me then? Yes, yes, yes. You also fight the curiosity, mm -hmm. aren't you? Yeah. CIA assassination training. Ooh. No doubt. You and Miss Duma will enjoy trading grim tales over coffee. Hmm. Okay. Maybe I underestimated you. Okay, so let's just ask him about the camera. Because, my friend, I do not intend to get these hands dirty during our trip abroad. I can, however, by means of this camera, provide an extra pair of eyes and ears. Mm -hmm. No. 
It is a work in progress. Okay, let's just ask him this prompt too while we're at it. My reputation has preceded me. <laughs> I can assure you my journey has taken many unexpected and, dare I say, unpredictable turns. I am quite content without a gun in hand. Sounds foolish to me. A person with nothing to lose has nothing to protect. <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> now, if you don't mind, I must delay no further. Marshal expects a way into that black site, and I shall not disappoint. Sounds good. Okay. Ooh, we have some more money now as well. We have 1400. We can purchase new stations or purchase things from the existing bench we have over here. Ooh, look at that. We have a lot of stuff now. We can get last stand. Oh, oh, the enemies are cooked. They are so cooked. They won't know the wrath that is last stand. Do you have anything else to say? Pick up some smokes while you're in DC. Yeah. No. Oh my god. Anyways, we have talked to Felix, so let's see if Marshall has anything else to say. Mission info is up on the board. Wow, thanks. These, these are very uh, one-sided conversations. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end my video here. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me play the first two campaign missions of Black Ops 6 today. The campaign has been very interesting so far, and I've been playing it like a noob as well. So I'm very happy that I decided to play on Recruit for that very reason, because this is a whole new take on the campaign that I'm not used to. And I'm having a lot of fun playing it on Recruit too. It's just that there's so many new mechanics within this campaign that I'm learning as I'm playing. And so far, it's been very fun to play, and I'm really enjoying it. With that said, though, I I'm gonna go ahead and wrap things up here. I hope you guys are enjoying watching me play the Black Ops 6 campaign so far. Let me know what you guys think of it in the comments down below. I would love to know. And with that being said, I hope you guys have a fantastic day and evening. Take it easy and peace. Bye!